Okay, we want to thank you all for tuning in, logging on to another episode of Illuminati News Hour, right here on Illuminati Radio. I'm your host, I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. My co-host is Brother Lamig Israel. If you are new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you'll be notified as I bring you more breaking news stories to a computer screen near you. Hit that like button also, and look in the description box below, there's a lot of goody goody goodies in there. And Jess, well, she was due for one. Because she ain't had one since never. The last time I heard something happening from Beyonce was, I believe it was in 2016 or 17, when her backup dancer had caught a seizure on stage. That was the last time I heard of her doing something. But still, her backup dancer still didn't die. So this should be her first sacrifice, her own damn cousin. Let's go ahead and hear this. Brother Israel? This is coming from NewYorkDailyNews.com. Article headlines, rapper fatally shot in Texas, apartment believed to be Beyonce's cousin. Now, get this, people. He was shot and killed Tuesday, the 26th. Representation of God, not not my God. My God is a higher, but their God, the God they worship. Twenty six represents that. You understand? So, with all that being said, they announced his death. To was it yesterday? On the thirtieth. Uh, they announced it last night. Last night. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. A four, what, what time did he announce it? 4.14 p.m. 4.14. What? One four four. You know, yes, they, just mixed, they just mixed it. You know, they just, they just mixed up a little bit. But if you look at it, it's one four four. Which, which one four four is the same, is the same equivalent of... The, uh, when, um, Beyonce and Jay-Z were so-called married. One, no, no, actually not so-called married, was so-called had blue ivory. Oh, I was about to say married. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> when they so-called had blue ivory, because they had blue ivory on the one four four numerology date. Yes. Oh, wow. That's... So with all this being said, this being that this falls on the anniversary year of that, I won't be too surprised. This is maybe the end of uh, Beyonce and Jay Z's coming to get being together. Actually, you know what? That makes a lot of sense because of what. Remember uh, what, what uh, we were talking about with um. Miss Lorinda? Yes. And she was mentioning that, that they, they are getting ready to, you know, split and mm -hmm. come out with their uh, actual days. Mm-hmm. That makes total sense. I think that's exactly what this is for. Yeah, Jay-Z just bailed out his bay. No. <laughs> and who knows who Beyonce's bay is? We know it's not a guy. Honestly, it might. If I, if it, honestly, it might be that Sasha. <laughs> Sasha fears. <laughs> okay. I'm Sasha. Yeah, yeah, that's not a coincidence that that rapper girl's name is Sasha. <laughs> yeah, honestly. Yeah, and like, you actually opened my eyes to that. I wasn't even thinking about that before, but yeah, I think that that makes a lot of sense now. Yeah. <laughs> On the anniversary day, they know what they doing, and that's why they waited until this no name rapper come out with this. Cause come on, we ain't heard this guy, this rapper, have not been hot until today. Kind of, kind of reminds you of Jay Z's son. He ain't been hot never. But yet his father is so-called a billionaire. How does that make sense? 
Your father's a billionaire, but yet you in Brooklyn struggling to rap. Wow. Go ahead. Uh, let's go ahead and read this article, uh, Brother Israel. This is um, where it's coming from, the article headline once again. This is New York Daily News.com. Article headline is rapper Faley shot in Texas apartment believed to be Beyonce's cousin. Mm -hmm. It drops January 30th, 2021 at 4.14 p.m. A search was underway in Texas on Saturday for a woman wanted in connection with the shooting death of 34-year-old rapper who was reportedly Beyonce's cousin. So they're going to blame this on some woman the same way they doing the same they using the same mixture as they did Jennifer Hudson to keep Jennifer Hudson in the clear what do they do they blame Jennifer Hudson's brother-in-law Jennifer Hudson's brother-in-law is in prison to this day for a crime that he did not commit all because Jennifer Hudson wanted to you know what I'm saying kill her family for fame go ahead a search was underway in Texas on Saturday for a woman wanted in connection with the shooting death of 34-year-old rapper who is reportedly Beyonce's cousin, rapper Martel the Ruin, uh, who performed under the stage name Cardone, was found dead during a welfare check at his San Antonio apartment on Tuesday, according to San Antonio Express News. An unidentified friend requested authorities stop by the performer's home after not hearing from him for a few days. A few days. Let's see. Uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Five days, to be exact. <laughs> Five days. You mean to tell... You mean to tell me that man is that less important that he can go five days without his girlfriend, without without or his wife, or you know what I'm saying? Without his mama, his you know what I'm saying? His sister, any of his family member, his friends. Nobody wanted to check on this man for five days. That shows you how irrelevant this man was. And it's funny how uh, Tuesday lands on 26. Yeah. And you know what? If I don't live here from nobody in a day, I'm going to have people calling me. But yet this man <laughs> can go missing for five days. And nobody said, well, you know, we, we haven't heard from Cardone. Where Cardone at? Don't he have a girlfriend? Isn't he a rapper? Yeah, isn't he a rapper? You mean, was his, his girlfriend must have been, you know what I'm saying, spreading them cheeks to somebody else. Because you mean to tell me he went five days and his girlfriend did not know? Didn't want to know who, what he was, he was doing? Like something, someone had him on, no? So you mean to tell me this nigga didn't get no ass for five days? That's what they're telling you. You, you. you know what I'm saying? Well, I mean, he couldn't. He was dead. I, <laughs> I mean, I mean, but, hey, no other girls. I'm. He's a rapper. I'm pretty sure he got a lot of girls in his phone. Yeah, he, he must got some groupies. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? The Ruin, who was signed with a Sony-affiliated record label, most recently released his single, Magic, in 2020. His and, last full length. And his single, Magic, you know what I'm saying? And what is Beyonce known for? Black Magic. Doing voodoo witchcraft rituals. That dropped last year. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead. And and that dropped last year, and it just so happens that a woman by the name of Sasha, who happens to be Beyonce's, <laughs> who Beyonce's demon is called, because Beyonce's demon is called Sasha Fears, right? So it's, <laughs> so, 
a girl actually by the name of Sasha kills his cousin, her cousin. We can't make this stuff up, yo. Yo, this is... Link album, Trunk Bag, came out in 2016. Trunk, Trunk Bag. And Lil Wayne's song is called Trunk Fit. Oh, no, no that's, his, that's his clothing line, Trunk Fit. Yeah, Trunk Fit. This is a Trunk Bag. Trunk bag. So I guess the they put him in a trunk and he's in a body bag. That's what it is. That's, that's probably the symbolism to that. Yeah. Trunk bag. Trunk bag. You know what I'm saying? You in a trunk. A coffin is another word for a trunk. And oh, so he had four years to uh, yeah, four years to uh, have that magic come out. Yeah. Trunk bag. Uh, four years apart because it came out in 2016. Mm-hmm. Which is another ritual. Oh, man, this is this is a whole ritual, people. Mm -hmm. Um, Brian Mitchell, owner of Finger Maze Studio and a friend of the ruins, describes a musician as quiet and humble despite his familiar familial connection with uh, superstar Beyonce. Quiet. You mean quiet. I don't, I never heard of a quiet rapper. Have you, Brother Israel? That's holding a pistol. <laughs> yeah, I mean, come on, just give it around. I never heard of no quiet rapper. There ain't no such thing as no quiet rapper. You know what a quiet rapper is? A non-rapper. Somebody who don't rap at all. For example, uh, who, who, who just talks, uh, says the story over a beat? Uh, what's his name? Um, Soldier Boy. Soldier Boy just talks over a beat. Yeah. Saying something. That's not, that, that's quiet. But even then, he's not quiet. <laughs> he's not quiet. Uh, Especially on his lives. Yeah, a quiet rapper who got a pistol sitting in front of a Benz as his picture. Kodak Black will be considered quiet in his Instagram videos. Yeah, that that's quiet right there. Yeah, that that's, that's definitely quiet. quiet. Just staring and eating like a cow. Even though you give him chewing, still quiet. He's not saying nothing is coming out of his mouth except. <laughs> There's something wrong with that boy. <laughs> That's not even something he would even mention to people, he told KSAP. Cardone was one of those who rose and shined bright, brighter than you know. Some of those that yeah. was in the room with him. Yeah, he rose and shined bright. We didn't hear from him until now. Kind of like that Biggie song. You're nobody till somebody kills you. Then you got P. Diddy in the background talking about, I don't want to die. I don't want to die. That's crazy. You know what I'm saying? We didn't hear about this idiot. This We didn't hear about this rapper until he did. He had two, oh, he had an album, you know what I'm saying, and a track called Magic. And nobody heard a nail one of them. Probably the people in his city, Houston. Haven't heard of none of them until now. Single ladies, the singer has not commented publicly on his death. Authorities earlier this week, earlier this week declared 21-year-old Sasha Hare the primary suspect in the ruins murder of a warrant has been issued for her arrest and she remains at large. Okay, what's this lady name again? Sha Sasha Scare. Sasha Scare. And what is Beyonce's um, so-called demon? Sasha Fears. Fears is you f fearing. It's like, you know what I'm saying? Uh, a fear technique. Sasha fears. Yeah, and Sasha scares. And scares. Sasha scares. 
Well, we don't make this up. This, this is this is an actual news report, right, brother Israel? Yeah, yeah. This one, yeah. So Sasha's demon is Sasha Fears, and the person that killed, so-called killed, her cousin is Sasha Scares. How can we make that shit up? <laughs> Just tell me how. Scare, who was also reportedly involved in a San Antonio music scene in April, released a single produced by Cardone. And she's a rapper. Who actually uh, had, a, uh, had a single produced by Cardone. And what Cardone. did Beyonce say when she was doing that interview? She said, I don't know, He co it comes out when I'm on stage. Sasha fears. Is this the woman that comes out when you're on stage, Beyonce? <laughs> I don't know what. She was previously charged with aggravated assault with a deadly weapon after a 2019 shooting that left one man dead and another injured, according to court records. Damn, Beyonce, you got a bait that's uh, harder than you are? Wow. She's willing to come out and shoot a nigga. Sasha scares and Sasha fears. <laughs> you can't make this up. This is a this is an actual news article, people. <laughs> oh Lord. Anyway, this is news. I want to thank you all for tuning in, logging on to another episode of Illuminati News Hour right here on Illuminati Radio. I'm your host. I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. My co-host is Brother Lamig Israel. If you are new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you'll be notified every time we drop this juicy news. Hit that like button also. And there's a lot of goodies in the description box below. If you want to join my exclusive Facebook Messenger group, you can do so by sending me a friend request to my Facebook page, which is PSTR Michael Smith on Facebook, and I'll add you to the group. Till next time, stay tuned. God bless you.